Bonjour à tous, je m'appelle Edouard et je suis le prof de français aujourd'hui. Aujourd'hui, c'est mercredi. Bienvenue mercredi et bienvenue à le cours de français pour les enfants. Hello, everybody. It is Wednesday. Thank you very much for joining uh, me today. I'm super excited that you guys are all here today. So, uh, I changed the time just a little bit. So if you guys are watching uh, or watching this video uh, in, in rerun, after after it saved. Uh, thank you for understanding and, and sorry I changed the time last minute. I have some things that I have to do, um, but here we go. On y va, let's go. Uh, we're now on level B for Francais and I'm super excited. We've done this one before, but we're gonna see some verbs and some questions. Uh, Allons-y. C'est le printemps. C'est le printemps. Le soleil sort des nuages. Le soleil sort des nuages. The sun comes out of the clouds. And les nuages masculins. Les fleurs sortent de la terre. This is plural, so we have sort. The flowers come out of the ground. Les vers sortent de la terre. Les plantes sortent de la terre. Les feuilles sortent des bourgeons. Les oiseaux sortent des œufs. I put this mark here because when it's plural, des œufs, you don't say the F. But here, you actually do with it when there's one egg, un œuf. Très bien. Les animaux sortent de chez eux. C'est le printemps partout dans la nature. Okay, guys. So. Uh, I'm going to read this one more time, a little bit faster, now that you know some of these words. Um, the verb today is sorti, and we've done this before, to leave, when it was, we were doing some action verb, sorti, uh, but it also means to exit or to go out or come out. And so here, the uh, plants and animals are coming out of different places. Oh, désolé. Bon. Le soleil sort des nuages. Les fleurs sortent de la terre. Les vers sortent de la terre. Les plantes sortent de la terre. Les feuilles sortent des bourgeons. Les oiseaux sortent des œufs. Les animaux sortent de chez eux. C'est le printemps partout dans la nature. Très bien. OK, everybody. So let's go as promised. We're going to look um, at... Uh, some of these <clears throat> verbs. So the verb aujourd'hui, c'est sortir. Ici, boom. Okay, everybody. So this is the verb sortir. Écoutez et répétez. Je sors. Tu sors. Il, elle, on sort. Nous sortons. Vous sortez. Il, elle, sort. Encore une fois. One more time. Je sors. Tu sors. Il, elle, on sort. Nous sortons, vous sortez, et il, elle sort. La négation maintenant, c'est je ne sors pas, tu ne sors pas, il ne sort pas, nous ne sortons pas, vous ne sortez pas, et il, elle ne sort pas. OK, so that's the conjugation. So I leave, you leave. Uh, in the story, we're using le, which is here, or le, which is here. Um, it leaves or it comes out. He or she comes out, okay? Or leaves or exits. But in the story, because we're talking about le printemps, c'est le printemps, it's springtime, we're using uh, the definition of uh, to come out of the ground, to come out of the clouds, to come out of the sky, uh, etc. So the question for today, sorry, the question word for today is U, U. So U means where, okay? So repeat after me, U, where. So I have some questions here from the story using U. So in this one, I've actually, in these examples, I've actually had, ha, you'll see do. So D apostrophe, so it's from where come out the flowers. From where, from where come out the sun, okay? so. Let's see if you can answer the question based on the story. I'm going to ask these questions. You answer at home, and then we're going to go back to the story and see if you got them right. 
D'où sortent les fleurs? OK. D'où sortent les fleurs? Mm -hmm. D'où sort le soleil? D'où sort le soleil? OK. D'où sortent les verres? D'où sortent les verres? Where do the um, worms come out of the earthworms? And then you, where do you leave or where do you exit? D'où sors-tu? D'où sors-tu? Je sors de l'école. I leave or I exit the school. Je sors, uh, je sors de l'école. Très bien. So, d'où sortent les fleurs? D'où sort le soleil? And d'où sort les verres? Okay. So, let's go back to the story and see if you can remember. Bon. Oops. Oop, oop, oop. Un, un moment, s'il vous plaît. Bon. Ici, c'est le printemps. Le soleil sort des, no de, des nuages. Les fleurs sortent de la terre. Les vers sortent de la terre. Les plantes sortent de la terre. Les feuilles sortent de, des bourgeons. Bourgeons is um, buds, right? The buds, the leaves are coming out of the buds. Bourgeons. Les oiseaux sortent des œufs. Les animaux sortent de chez eux. C'est le printemps partout dans la nature. C'est le printemps partout dans la nature. OK, and the verb for aujourd'hui, c'est sorti. OK, répétez s'il vous plaît. Je sors, tu sors, il, elle, on sort. Nous sortons, vous sortez, and il, elle, sort. And the question word for today is où, right? So, d'où sortent les fleurs? OK, so, les fleurs sortent de la terre. OK, uh, d'où sort le soleil? D'où sort le soleil? Let's go back to the question. D'où sort le soleil? OK, le soleil sort des nuages. Des nuages. Right, so the sun comes out of the clouds. OK, so let's do a quick little vocabulary check. OK, so le printemps is springtime. Des nuages are some clouds or clouds plural, and you can say les nuages. La terre is the earth, if it's capitalized, or the ground or the dirt, right? La terre. And then les fleurs, the flowers. La fleur, one flower. Les vers, the earthworms, right? We've seen that one a couple of times, actually. Les plantes, the plants, right? It's very similar to English. La terre, the ground. Les feuilles, feuilles, the leaves, les feuilles. Les oiseaux, the birds. And un oeuf, one egg. Okay, des oeufs, des oeufs, uh, many eggs, right? Plural, so we don't pronounce the F-S for des oeufs, but you do un oeuf, okay? Tricky, huh? Les animaux, plural of animal the animals, and chez eux, chez toi is your house or at your home, right? It's a very French thing uh, to say chez toi or chez eux, their house, the animal's house or homes. C'est le printemps partout, everywhere, in, dan. we've done that one before. La nature, c'est la même chose qu'en qu anglais, okay, right? C'est la même chose, right? La nature. Okay, so wrap it up. Now that you know some the vocabulary, you know the uh, the verb, which is sorti, and you know the questions for each of these is où, which is where, but we're using from where, which is do, right? So, c'est le printemps. Le soleil sort des nuages. Les fleurs sortent de la terre. Les vers sortent de la terre. Les plantes sortent de la terre. Les feuilles sortent des bourgeons. Les oiseaux sortent des œufs. Les animaux sortent de chez eux. C'est le printemps partout dans la nature. Okay, everybody. Um, that's all I have for today. If you're watching this video um, because you came here at 10.30, um, I apologize. Uh, watch the video. C'est la même chose. Leave a comment, like, uh, and merci et à demain.